Hi, I'm Luis Castaño. Today's tip of the month is properly monitoring differential pressure. Last month we discussed understanding differential pressure, but now how do, can we use it as a tool to keep our bag house in good shape? As we said last month, differential pressure tells you what's going on inside the bag house. Basically, the way a bag house works, airflow comes in, dust is kept up on the filters, clean air comes out. Differential pressure is a measurement of the amount of dust on the filters and you want that to control that. It cannot be way too much because you're restricting flow and you shouldn't clean it too much. But a good number is around four, maybe five inches of differential pressure. Now we gotta be careful that it's only from the clean side to the dirty side. What if you have the probes on the inlet and the outlet? That's called overall differential pressure and it's a little bit different because of mechanical losses. So make sure that your probes are on the clean and dirty side, not at the inlet and the outlet. There's a big difference there. So check for that and make sure you're monitoring just the differential pressure and keeping a good number to know that your bag house is healthy. If you would like to discuss this subject in more detail with one of our sales engineers, please call us. We can help you optimize your systems. Thank you.